Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park, Toyota located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2020 Toyota RAV4 XLE. Now the most suitable features on this XLE is its power moonroof. You also have your power lift gate and your heated front seats. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2020 Toyota RAV4 XLE. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this XLE is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lights. Taking a closer look just over on the side, you do have your 17 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Entered signal lamps, foldable mirrors, and then if you take a look on the inside of the mirror, you're gonna find your blind spawning indicator. Now with that indicator, it'll actually light up just looking at there is another vehicle right beside you. Smart key system with it. And taking a look up top, you'll find the roof rack, and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is magnetic gray. Taking a closer look just at the front dash as well as the front seats, you do have your cloth interior, power driver's seat with lumbar support. Automatic high beams, window wiper de-icer, heat steering wheel, and power lift gate release. Along with that, you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks, and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function, Bluetooth connectivity, volume control, voice recognition, cruise control, mode select, and seek function. Now the other nice thing is it does have the push button start. So all you have to do is put your phone on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Taking a look at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on here. So if we take a closer look. You have your fuel economy with the distance to empty and digital speedometer, but you can also go through and take a look at your lane departure alert, trip info, all-wheel drive, and then you have your settings menu with the lane trace assist, pre-collision system, and a couple of other additional features as well, and you'll find your messages menu as well. Taking a look at the center dash area, if you go inside your menu screen, you'll find your audio phone apps as well as a couple of other additional features now. With the apps menu, it's part of the Intune app suite, so as long as you have it on your phone, you can use such apps as the Scout GPS app, which allows you to stream your maps from your phone onto the touch panel display. You can also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sports scores, just depending on what your preferences are. Hazard lights, dual zone climate control settings, traction control on and off, heated seat controls for your driver and your passenger, USB and power outlet, mounted to a automatic transmission, and as you can see, you have your Eco Normal Sport with your snow, mud, sand, rock, and dirt feature. Now, if we take a closer look just up top here, you'll find your open and close for the power moonroof with the sunglass case holder and then taking a look at the backup camera. As you can see, you have those nice guiding lines and they're making things much easier for you when you're backing into a stall. And you can also change up the backup camera view to a more dynamic view or the traditional backup camera view you're used to. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located on the back of the tailgate, you'll find your backup camera on the left-hand side and the rear hatch release located just underneath. Closing in on the rear cargo space, as you can see, you do have the cargo cover in the back, which is nice because it can cover up your valuables just by going from place to place. 60-40 split for the rear seat, so if you need more additional space, it's available to you. And then taking a look underneath the floor. You have your spare tire as well as your jack and toolkit, so if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch, you know exactly where it's located. The other nice thing is that you can flip this piece over just in case the cargo that you're hauling is a little bit rougher on the carpet side. And that if you want to lower it down a little bit farther, you can, just in case you do need the additional space. And you do have a power adjustable tailgate, so if you hold down the button for approximately two seconds at the height you'd like it at, It'll beep a couple of times and when you close it and open it again, it'll open up to this height. However, if you want to reset the height for yourself, hold down the button for more than four seconds, it'll beep several times, and when you close it and open it again, it'll open up to the maximum height. A couple of the uses for that power tailgate is if you're a little bit shorter or if your garage is a little bit lower, you can prevent the back of your tailgate from being damaged. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.